Why? Hello and welcome everybody. It is Pox again. So before I start, let me know how you guys feel about the audio. I know a couple of you guys are having some issues. But anyway, in this video, we want to go ahead and uh, I want to talk about sextants and kind of how I feel about them and like the sextant blocking mechanic. And I want your guys' thoughts on it too. Um, so just to get started for people who don't know, sextants are essentially another currency that you will use on maps. You have three different types and tiers of sextants. You've got the white, which is associated with these maps, the lower tiers. The uh, journeyman, which would be for the, what is a six through 10. And then you have the master, which is for your red tier. Now, sextants can be pretty expensive. Uh, prime example here, yellow sextants are about five C per in hardcore currently. Uh, apprentice ones are like two C and masters are like five plus. Now, the value doesn't really matter. It's just the fact that they are worth a bit of currency. So the whole point of sextants and what they're used for is to essentially add additional density to the map that you want to shape and continuously run. Now, there are many different ways to use sextants, but this is the more common way. So a prime example is if we look here, I have area is inhabited by an additional invasion boss. So this is not really a mod that you would want. You would want density. So if I roll this over, we now have area contains additional monsters that deal fire damage. And this applies to the toxic sewer right here. So the method that we have used here is a method called sextant blocking. There are a bunch of circles if you see all of this stuff here, right? But none of these circles do anything to the actual toxic sewer. So all of this stuff over here and over here and over here is basically called sextant blocking. It forces you, or well, if you want to do it, you essentially lock all the mods you do not want on maps that are adjacent but not actually touching your toxic sewer or the map that you want. Um, which makes it so that you can roll the mods you do want on that selected map, right? So for example, because we have over here on Mausoleum, uh, Mausoleum is located here, and it's hard to see the circle, but this main circle around Mausoleum that is touching the cemetery and the hollowed ground and the waste pool, which is the found items dropped, uh, it's the one that's highlighted basically. These ma uh, maps cannot roll it, which means that this map cannot roll it, which means since this map has it, it cannot apply to toxic sewers. It's kind of complicated and there's much better methods of explaining it. But anyway, I wanted to get your guys' opinions on this because I personally really don't like this method. I think that this is not really good for new players and even for experienced players, I feel that people that know how to do this method um, kind of monopolize on the sextant market and I just don't really like that. I feel like wasting a lot of currency to do this is just kind of a currency sink that's not really necessary to the game. I find that most people don't even use their sextants, they actually just sell them. And I think that, you know, that's kind of understandable considering if you look at a lot of currency like Chaos Orbs and Exalted Orbs and Nullament Orbs, etc. Most people don't use those currency, they sell them, but sextants are much more common. You know, you'll find a sextant maybe every other map, every couple of maps, and they just pool up. And I think it would be really cool if they maybe revisited these sextants and maybe make it so instead of having a bunch of random effects like, uh, you know, reduced effective curses and stuff, if they made it more like monster themed, right? We already roll our maps. So when you're rolling your maps, you're going to have a variety of different things uh, that are going to apply on your maps, right? Most of them are negative, as you can see here. So why not make the sextants, since they're a lot more expensive, a bit more positive? By positive, I just mean adding density. Obviously, it's going to be, you should always be, uh, make the game dangerous or the map dangerous, and nobody's asking for the game to be easier, but maybe just a bit easier to understand, right? Um, because I feel in the current meta that's, that sextants are in, it just doesn't, it's not very, I don't know, most people don't really even get to do anything with them. So... Anyway, I just wanted your guys' thoughts and opinions on it and whatnot. Let me know how you guys feel about sextants. Uh, like I said, I personally would like to see them revisit this system and maybe change it around a little bit. But let me know what you guys think. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, please feel free to like, share, and subscribe. And remember, you can catch me streaming live every day at twitch.tv slash pox. Hope to see you guys all tomorrow. Take care, everybody.